she was the one person who understood me. I understood her. Ubunola took literally his secret zam to the grave. She took all my secrets to the grave, Ubunola. And I want to promise her and I'm trying I will take her secrets to the grave. It's 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 even the English are going to lap right now. I don't believe that the lap, the Zotheta, and the Benga Bulela. Um, we've spoken about death so many times. Um. But my death never her death. I always told her, everyone on the sea, they will tell you, but I always speak about my death. And she hated that. Um, I speak about this so many times. I always told her, I always um, so for me, just to be here to talk in Obulewa is just crazy. Obulewa, uh, I met her through another friend of ours who tragically lost his life um, to accident, who accompanied to Jezil many moons ago. Wati welcomes the room. Except to man, Obulela loves your music and she wants to meet you. Make time, my son, be so cool. And of course, I mean, this is Zahara, you know, and I was like, of course, I would love to meet her, you know, and for the longest time, I couldn't make it to her place. And then we started talking on the phone every time. Which is it was at her house, so we talk on the phone. Um, and I realized even then how bubbly she was, how full of life Ubulala was. And eventually I made it to her house. And from that day on, me and her were like this. Ubulala. Nova was emotional during that uh, presentation or speech about Uzahara and uh, he was comforted by uh, Ringo Malingozi and the MC of the day and um, there you see Ringo coming to our right day and comforting our musician Vusi Nova that's ring all day with the glasses and uh, in no time he got the strength to go back and deliver what was expected of him the beautiful message about Zahara <laughs> Special man, you know, she was extraordinary. Um, whenever we were together, everyone around us would have to understand. But all the time, all the time, morning until night, you know, and, and that's why I say. 
for me right now, she was the one person who understood me. I understood her. Ubrola took literally a secret them to the grave. She took all my secrets to the grave, Ubrola. And I want to promise her and plan to I will take her secrets to the grave. I will never, never, ever declare my name by my name. I will never, ever You know, when when she was in the hospital, we frequently go there to Mama Ike and her sisters in the um, And the one day, it was Thursday, the Thursday before she passed on, I walked in there as usual in the morning, 11. And I was walking towards Apollo Coil all the time. And on this matter, I had and I turned back and when I looked, she was in a private room, sitting in Bund, without all those pipes. So for me, it was sister's own. And she was smiling. And when I walked in there, and I said to her, Ndandini, don't ever do that again. Don't ever scare us like that ever again. You know? And we sat there and we spoke. Like we spoke Janice Pearl and Gwafila no Mama and I said to her well, from now on I'm going to guide you I'm going to make sure I'm going to make sure that you only know me as an alien and when I left that day I kissed her on the forehead and I said I love you and she said I love you I left the hospital believing but I'm feeling the next day Somebody said, because to pack her clothes in 13 Akotuge. And the very same night, I found out that she, she got worse, and, and that was so devastating. The reason I'm bringing this story up is that I think God gave her one last chance to say goodbye to her family and to me. God gave us one more chance. And I want to say to God right now, thank you for that. Thank you for giving us that one last time. For me to say to her, Nyatana, and I say the same thing back. Bulawa, I want to promise you a second thing. Your sisters, your brother, rest in the second. I will take care of them. I'll make sure about it. That was the last witch of Vusnova to Zahara, our diva, saying goodbye. Cheers.